Welcome to episode 8 of Infamous Second Son. Uh, today I am going to go through, or we, because it's always our playthrough, because I like doing that. Uh, <laughs> our uh, playthrough, I am going to go through and do every single side quest I can do. Actually, I can go back to the first item, so I'm going to do everything I can in total. I'm going to try and 100% every single area, if possible. going to start with on this side. Oh, I thought I got all of the black scores. Ooh, that's even better. going to start with that right there. For not playing in a good bit, I am already in the groove. Fuck you. Yeah. Where's the guy over here? Oh, there you are! You piece of shit! Have a sword to the face! Where the fuck is it up here? There it is. Hello. I told him this to his face. But Hank Daughtry was smarter than I ever gave him credit for. The guy had escaped from a couple of jails before we came across him. Plus he managed to keep his head well in Curtin K. Except even the smartest inmates have problems with that he might have been the one who caused the transport accident up in San Jose Bay. The one that let himself and his other two conduits escape. Just think how different your world would be right now. 
now if he hadn't been on that transport. That's not you. You have a hood on. Where the fuck is this guy? I'm not looking at people because if I put my cursor over the boy for too long and I don't notice it's him, he will start making a break for it. I want to have the upper hand the entire time. It's like how you counter Wraith's uh, passive in Apex. No, you have a red. Okay. Hello. Am I just blind? Guessing. It's just an occurrence, so I don't really need to worry about him. Where the f There you are! Fuck you! Fuck you! Where'd you go? You piece of fuck! Job. Hell yeah. If Infamous ever does get multiplayer game modes like I suggested a couple episodes ago or even last episode I think I suggested it the That could not that cannot be a one-shot and different things like that Like there has to be a lot of balance tweaks, but the overall feel and design would be there Or at least could be there I thought because they didn't see me, I could just... Okay. Where's the mother? Where are you fucking at? 
Ja, motherfucker. Video is very easy to play. At least going good. Peeping toms. There's not really much to talk about this video, because I am just doing the basic stuff. Or... Yeah, everything's basic. The, uh, the very boring, just collect-a-thon stuff. That's in every infamous game. Yeet, motherfucker! I did not mean to go that way. That looked like it fucking hurt. Damn! Makes sense that guy surrendered. Fuck. Fucking bitch! I wasn't expecting boys, so I was scratching my ear. I smacked my stylus off my desk. Oh shit. Oh. I'll take that. Found my stylus, put it back on my desk. I got you, dude. I made it eventually. <laughs> Yeah, that was a DUP center. I should not have these again. Or was I just extra high and didn't grab all of these? I, I highly doubt that.
Can I get two? Hell yeah. Nope. Okay. Letting you do this. Did they? Did they just fucking killed themselves? Okay. I'm not even in the same section anymore. Okay. I am very glad I didn't just fall on that water there. It would have just killed me, like in every other infamous game, but it would have made me have to teleport to the ocean. Or not ocean. The shore. The fucky thing about stories like this, about uh, superheroes just being like the next evolution of man, this is gonna happen, if that's gonna happen, kind of thing. Like, it's... Human nature is xenophobic to an extent, and when you have such a deviation in just the next generation or a possible... Like, when there's enough deviation, it's like the root for racism xenophobia and different things like that it you don't look like me you don't act like me you don't have the same things like me so you're not me fuck off that that is what i mean by xenophobia and just having the ability to glow it might not even be anything special just the ability to glow will have massive xenophobia for just about anything and everything and it, the likelihood of, like, My Hero Academia type world happening where everyone just coexists with powers is so fucking slim. The likelihood of every co every country ever weaponizing the fuck out of that and using that as their main defense force, offense force, like, everything just about is way more likely than them just coexisting. <laughs> And it's such a bullshit thing. And I say bullshit, even though I fully understand that it's in... Humans are a warlike species. Humans, even though not a lot of humans like fighting, not a lot of humans like getting into the fight, they will still go to social media or do something that actually annoys them, makes them want to talk shit or something like that, that annoyance, that anger. Sure, it's not in fists, but it could be in digital text, it could be in the words you say, it could be in different things like that. And everyone does something like that to an extent. There's very few that don't, but a lot of people do. And that's what makes us warlike. We want that fight. We want that... that... Aggression 
and it sucks that if there is a big enough deviation that we will take that aggression out on just about anything. I say we because it is very common that a lot of different countries all over the globe and a lot of different people and all sorts of things do it. Which is why it's a we. It's not just one group or one religion or one anything. It's people in general. Which, which is the duality of man. People suck, but people are the only things that can do the things people can do. So if humans get their head out of their ass and start just doing good, like good like helping the planet, growing more trees, just doing everything that they can, and not going overboard, mind you. There is overboard of like forcing everyone to have electric cars. Like that's overboard. Try and ease into it and make sure everything works and like fully dive into it, not just force it upon everyone. Is a good way to do it and a way to just save so much everything and the worst part and I, I, what I just said was talking about America and how America is doing bullshit things but if America goes fully green that will not stop every other country from polluting everything around them which is something bullshit that <sighs> Because of the divisions in every society everywhere, that there is no, there is no working together. And I want to try and fix that as much as I can, but there is no working together. Like the UN, for example, that literally can't work. Like, people get shit done there, but I don't know how much is actually getting shit done, because... All of them, a lot of those, not a lot of those, I think it's actually a lot of those countries that are in the UN have slave labor. Like, they should not be there, in my personal opinion, because they do not care about a United Nation. They care about easy money. They have slave labor and different things like that. It's, it's not what should be in a for the people, by the, not for the people, by the people, but that safety in everything and if america's there we should not have work if america's in something there should not be anyone working with or anything adjacent to anything america does because america stands for freedom if anyone that works with america is about slavery has slavery in any way shape or form that could that cannot stand because that it's against freedom which is what america stands for and that is why it's the best country in the world, and I've talked about stuff like that, but sorry about getting political. It's just logic. <laughs> Thinking through things is what I love to do, and that's why I'm not either side. Both sides have beautiful points. Just it, a lot of better points are on one side. And I, I do want to specify that because both sides have a lot of good points. The one side has a lot better points for running a government over... One has more societal ideas, more getting people to... Okay, on the surface... It looks like it's getting people to work together. But all the labels, all the divisions, all the separations makes it where there's, like I said, xenophobia, that extra aggression because they can have that extra label to have as like a shield and a spear at the same time to have that friction. And a lot of people use it, a lot of people do it. It's bullshit. But without that, it's disguised as cohesion disguised as helping everyone out having those extra labels those extra things but it's really just hindering everyone and i understand that those labels do help a lot of people but there's it's not it does not need to have a hundred labels for and i do want to specify this i hope i don't offend a lot of people and this is not me trying to offend it's just scientific terms the sexuality thing there can be so many different sexualities and it's not needed to have that as your main thing it's who you are at home it's who you are doing your own thing but that does not need to be a forefront thing that does not need to be your identity which a lot of people seem to forget 
that sex isn't everything. And going with that, the difference between sex and gender is gender is what's in your pants. Sex is how you feel, so to speak. It's more complex than that, but simplistic boiled down, that's the difference. Which is why when people say there's 21 genders or however there are many sexualities there is now, it's sexualities instead of genders. Because there's only two genders. Genders are like for any species ever. It's humans are not a complex, ever-changing species. They still have male and female. And little things like that is just... <sighs> Disguise is good things and can be good things, but is not necessarily and can and easily lead to a lot of bullshit like it is now, is what I was trying to say. Because going down the little information tracks to help fully understand what I'm trying to say. Because without those deviations, without those divisions, there wouldn't be a lot of problems there is nowadays. Or there most likely would be a lot of problems there is nowadays, but not the same problems because different things like that. A lot of bullshit. <laughs> uh... Sorry about completely getting rid of the flow of the video. Uh, just please do not be upset with me about how I'm saying it, or what I'm saying, so to speak. Because I do not try and offend. If you are offended, I am actually really sorry. Just I try my best to be as scientific as possible. In everything I say. Even when it comes to games. Because... I do like saying that there is a science to games. Like, there is a science to art, so to speak. Like, modern art is... Grown-up child art is the best way to put it, in my personal opinion. Like, there's no deeper meaning besides what the viewer wants to put on it. Like, uh... I Starry Night, I forget the person that makes it because I am not an art person, or I am an art person, but I don't know specifics. I never really know specifics. But... The person that made Starry Night, there was so much depth and beauty behind all of that. There, every brush stroke you can see just about with Starry Night and old paintings like that, Mona Lisa, different things like that, that is pure art. And there's a science behind it. There's a study you can do to it. And that is how I view games in general and different media, like uh, movies, games, and different things like that. But I view games above movies, pictures, uh, videos, because games are interactive. There's that extra depth to the game, to the art, than every other media because you can actually have your own movements your own inputs your own interaction with it and if done right with other like uh i okay i don't know any other games like this off the top of my head but like warhammer uh rogue traders the new game that came out or not new game i think it came out a couple months ago uh rogue traders it is a turn-based big world big exploration but it is turn-based strategy where every playthrough is going to be completely different i don't know another game like it off the top of my head but there is a lot of games like it not saying it's unique by any stretch of the imagination but that concept can be very good and i completely lost what i was trying to say i was trying to say something actually very cool Oh yeah, uh, how that is like the peak form of game art, so to speak, or that peak into what I, or the peak of what I was saying with how interactive this art form can be. And that is what's beautiful, the most beautiful thing about this art form, is the interactive ability. Even though what I just said is not a word, but it still works. Okay, I got this to do, that. Gonna knock out all of those and then gonna do that boss fight. Hello, big bitch. Please don't kill him. Ha. Oh. What sucks about playing good is that you always have to worry about civilian casualties. And it, having to worry about them makes it feel like you're going good, but always having to worry about them is fucking terrifying. Especially when there's people just scattered around everywhere. Because you can't just open fire. 
but going evil, it's the exact opposite. They are bonus points. And I... Saying what I just say makes it seem like I want to play evil above anything else. I actually really prefer going good, because it's a better story, it's a better experience overall. Just that little thing is extra depth into the game that is simultaneously fun as annoying. Oh, that's over here. Is that it right there? No. Oh. Oh, I walked out of it. <laughs> I guessing it's in here. Where the fuck? Ha ha! I am already halfway through the video. I'm just going to speed run through this so next episode I can just speed run through the campaign. Well, that was some jink. In this section of the map, it's just better to have video for the aerial mobility. Because you can go from building to building. And now I'm going to swap back to Neon to have that amazing super. Oh, the... Neons up here. Hi, you have reached the DUP helpline. Do you have a bioterrorist incident to report? Uh. A damn bioterrorist is on the loose. His painting skills are top notch. Uh, I, I, I mean, defiling your billboard. I'm fearing this is a trend. We will address this immediately. It's a good thing I went neon. Can't go for headshots. Haul. Oh. Shit. Shit! And there's a sumo- you motherfuckers. Super, 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 super! Oh. I 
I hope that's all of them. I don't think it is. Holy shit, it was. Hell yeah. Where the hell is this one? Where the fuck? There's no way it's all the way up there. Where the... Okay, then. Am I just blind? I don't think I'm just blind. Well, shit. I think I might, okay, I might be able to get this one island done, and that is a big fucking might. Next episode, I can focus on the other island, if I haven't already done that. Have I done that? No, I have not, just judging by that. Where the hell? Okay. Where did concrete shoulder pads go? Okay, then. Uh, I have realized something, which is kind of cool, that this is my, not most viewed, I was going to say most viewed, I don't think it's my most viewed, but it's a very viewed series that I've actually been keeping up to, or not, I realized that I have been getting consistent views on this series so far. I have been getting at least 17, at least, yeah, 17, 10 round there views on this series thus far. And that is actually pretty cool. Thank you for the views, and I hope I keep being entertaining enough to earn your time. Because if I'm not entertaining enough to earn your time, why are you watching me? <laughs> Thank you, but I, I want you to go spend your time doing something you actually like.
man, a plan, and an aerosol can. It's awesome how that's a hazmat symbol. For those that have been watching the entire series thus far, what has been your favorite, uh, your favorite element for me to be using? Because I ask because my favorite is uh, not, my favorite is neon to use. Video. The reason why I keep saying uh, keep trying to say video is because video throws off everything I'm wanting to say because I'm keep wanting to say elements, but video is not a fucking element. It's video. <laughs> <laughs> and out of all of the different abilities I can use, that's a lot better for my brain. Out of all the different abilities I can use, what is your favorite? I ain't got two people to heal. Wait, is that three? I got three people to heal. Hiller. I am really uh, surprised that DUP caravan did not see me. Yeah, I don't mind if I do. That completely broke. Hello, motherfucker. Spot check, don't fail me now. No, you're not him. Are you him? No, that's black. Are you? No, you're female. Think about what I just said. I mean, that's a black man. And the guy in the picture is white. Where the fuck is the guy? There you are, motherfucker. Delete thyself.
Oh, that's... No, is that actually in the tree? My instinct wants to say it's in a tree. It's in a tree! Where the fuck? Right there, ha! Not even gonna worry about fighting you. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Guess what? Another billboard is covered by a bioterrorist. Whatever will I do? I recognize your voice, sir. I don't find this funny. We will handle you. All right, lady, bring it on. Where's your door? Come here, motherfuckers. Ah, oh, there's three sumo bitches. Do I have all of them? I do! Come here, motherfucker! Hell, is that four sumo? That's four sumo. Huh, they didn't even see the fourth. I am glad I used that when I did. Hell yeah. Well, okay, I don't have a lot of time left. I have about 20 minutes if I want to maximize the time, or about 20 minutes, even if I don't want to maximize the time, around there, for how much time I have left. Am I just an idiot? That's about 10, right? Yeah, around 10. I'm an idiot. Um, I have around 10 minutes. So, I am going to try my best to... Actually, that's a lot of shit. I'll try my best to completely get all of the shit here, complete this thing, and then do all the upgrades, because that actually has a lot of stuff. I don't think I'm going to have enough time for here. Thank you, it's cool.
shit. I want to head that way. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck! Oh, I didn't have another dash. I just exploded a poor individual. There is still... Where the fuck... Fuck! Hell yeah! I only got five minutes left. I do not think I'm gonna be able to get all this done. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to get all this done. Uh, shit. You know what? I'm gonna do that after getting the upgrades.
made the world a little better place. Well, I hope y'all enjoy the video and I'll catch y'all in the next one.